Hello everyone, welcome to Toadstool House Art. My name's Adele and this is a video of a penguin in the Lego shop um, because I got to go to Leeds. Uh, I stopped overnight. It was to see uh, my friends because uh, it was my birthday a couple of weeks ago uh, but I wasn't able to do anything so I was too busy. Um, so we went out and we had a couple of days in Leeds which was really nice because they had all the um, decorations up around the city. Uh, oh, this is just just a restaurant that I thought was really pretty because they got all the uh, all all the lights up, uh, and yeah, I had a really good time. Uh, we just sort of hung out. We got some food. I got sushi, and I got tom yum soup, which is the first time I've ever had it. Um, and if someone had described it like having lemongrass in it, I might have passed on it. But it was actually really good, you know, considering I don't generally like citrus with savory food. Savory food. It was really good. Uh, and I'd been craving sushi and I'd never had it from this place before and that was really good as well. They did put a lot of avocado in though. <laughs> oh and that at the back there, that's Inari which is uh, rice wrapped in sweet tofu. That is also one of my favourites. It's so good. Um, oh and my friends got me uh, cupcakes for my birthday. <laughs> so we had these uh, in the hotel but I didn't get any video of them lit because they, they kind of surprised me with it. Oh, and here we are. Um, this is mini golf, and I should put a little warning on that there is going to be some uh, coloured lights flashing because uh, of the place we were in. So I forget what this one's called, but we went on the uh, the jungle themed run. Um, so we played nine holes. Um, so there's all these sort of wacky um, sort of props around, and I failed miserably. Any time that the camera was on me, I did not did not do good at all oh my god yeah <laughs> my friends were being nice they said that one didn't count <laughs> um but yeah we like to go play uh mini golf uh i usually do a lot better but this time i did not do good at all like <laughs> close but not enough oh dear I'm just chasing the ball around uh. <laughs> <Yay>. <laughs> So awkward. Oh dear. So, but but these are a nice place. I forget what this one's called. It might be, it might be Put Locker. I'm not sure. God, typical. Now that I've come to record it, I cannot remember what it's called. Uh, but they also had these uh, giant wrestling bears in, and you played like golf between them. Um, yeah, bit bit strange. Not sure how they fit into the jungle theme, but you know. <laughs> So I had to have a video with one of those. And oh my god, sorry, this is just more sucking at playing golf. Like, I, I missed the pyramid. Um, it got into that trap door, but of course it didn't fall through, did it? No, no, not while I was playing. So I had, <laughs> had to give it a little prod. <laughs> and then it wouldn't come out of the hole at the bottom. Because <laughs> of course it wouldn't. Oh dear. I swear, as soon as the, the camera's on me, I can't can't play golf at all uh, we've we've been several times and I've been sucking so bad recently just just terrible which is really annoying because I used to be good I promise you I used to be good at mini golf see now that oh, no. that's witchcraft right there <laughs> like just jumped back out of the hole that's not fair okay that one was me that one was uh yeah that was my fault <laughs> <Yay>. <laughs> So awkward. Oh yeah, and they had a pig in a speedboat because um Yeah, because they did. <laughs> don't really know what that was about, don't know how that fits into the, the jungle theme. Uh yeah, but there's my score. I yeah, I lost. I got thirty-four. So I didn't lose by a huge amount, but damn it, I like winning. <laughs> anyway, then we decided to go through to one of the markets. And we walked through this uh, like shopping center, and I'm sorry about my thumb there in the corner, but this this one is so nice. I don't remember what this one's called, but this is the one where you find all the uh, designer shops, like the the really expensive ones. Um, but it's very pretty. But we went through to Kirk Kirkgate Kirkgate Market, I think it's called, because uh, I hadn't I've never really walked through there properly. I haven't been to Leeds that often. Uh, but they had this huge Christmas tree in this big open area that I didn't even know was there. 
Oh, and I got this great steam bun made with homemade tofu from this place. Um, unfortunately, I didn't get a video of the actual food because like with steam buns, you have to eat them really quickly while well, they're still good. Uh, but it was so nice. So we stopped there for a snack. And then we passed this bear and I don't know why it was just on its own. It looked like it passed out and its legs are so long. <laughs> I'm assuming it was from some sort of like Christmas display or something. But no, it's... <laughs> Just passed out uh, and then we when we were walking through the city on the way back to the uh, the train station they had uh, some some Christmassy bits like this ferris wheel and my phone does not do it justice there were so many more colored lights uh, but they all kind of look white here um, but it, it, it was really pretty really cold though <laughs> oh and we passed um, not sort of like a little fair with some rides uh, it must have been blooming cold up there. Like, <laughs> it was cold on the ground. I can't imagine what it would be. And they had one of these, like, fun houses. Uh, we didn't really have time to go and do any of that. Cause we, and we also had our, all our cases with us. Because uh, we were going to go be back to the train station later on. Uh, and we came home a bit early. And it might have been a good thing, too. Because when I got back, this is what the weather was doing. This was, I think, the next day? Um... So yeah, I mean, it looked, it was very pretty though, very Christmassy. Um, I'm not sure how widespread the snow was, but we, we got a good covering. It didn't last too long. Um, but here there's like the snowflakes are absolutely huge. <laughs> like, uh, so, so pretty. Uh, but we, uh, we have two outdoorsy cats, Charlie and Elsa, but we don't let them out uh, when it's snowing because they get too excited. Um, they like try to catch it and we don't want them like running off um, so yeah they have to they have to stay indoors so they have to stay indoors through all of this um, apparently Salem was trying to catch them at the window which was cute but I missed it uh, so here's Charlie just, just he's, he's much more chill when he's inside he just wants to to watch it oh and this little guy uh, my brother and his wife uh, their family they got a dog uh he's only little i think at this point he was 16 weeks uh he's called milo and my mum has made him a little jacket <laughs> for going out in so we were dog sitting for a couple of days and i was there on my own because uh, my brother and his wife went away for a little bit uh so yeah this is me taking him out for his walk when he when he finally gets into it and i did t teach him one trick <coughs> Good boy, good boy. Milo, down. Good boy, good boy. Milo, Milo, down. Good boy, good boy. So I've just been doing some mug printing because today was uh, a mug printing day because uh, I had some uh, personalised mugs that I needed to get done for Etsy. Uh, I've had quite a few of those um, and the most popular one has been uh, the Toadstool House design uh, quickly followed by the frog. So you can get, basically get any mugs on my Etsy uh, with a name on. So uh, they're just over there, but I don't think I'm going to show them on the channel because they are probably Christmas gifts. So I won't do that. Uh, but I also printed this design. These are my Christmas Tomptees. I can't remember if I painted these in 2019 or not. I think so. So I really like this design because it goes all the way around and they're all different. Uh, and I'm printing those off because I have one more Christmas fair to go. So I did one the other day and tomorrow, uh, which is Saturday, I have uh, just one more to go. Um, it's, it's only, it's like in my hometown, so it's at the bottom of my street. So yeah, I needed to do a top up of mugs because I had sold out of this design. Uh, I needed a few more frogs and I thought, why not do some, some Christmassy ones? So I'm kind of hoping they go. I'm only taking uh, three of the Christmas ones. Because obviously if I don't sell them at this one, they're, uh, <laughs> I'm kind of st Oops, excuse me, stuck with them till next year. So yeah, I've done mug printing and I think I'm going to print 
um, some of those nice linen notebooks I have because I haven't had the chance yet but they are completely sold out they sold out at my last convention so I have been meaning to top those up uh, yeah but before I do that I am going to get all of these uh, back in their boxes So I'm ready to print some notebooks now. Uh, I just spent some time uh, cutting all of these out. So these are all ready to go now. Uh, I just watched some, some YouTube videos while I did that. Uh, and my notebooks, uh, they've changed. They, they're they from the same supplier, but for some reason they have like a, kind of like this diary style print inside. Um, I mean, it's cute <laughs> instead of like the blank pages and things, but I think I'm gonna have to like describe them as um, like a diary notebook instead of just a notebook. So yeah, I'm doing how many I'm doing? I'm doing eight of these. Um, I don't think I've even had these up online yet because these always sell out. Um, especially the the toadstool house one and the the cow are definitely the most popular. Um, and then the sort of <laughs> last one is uh, is this mug. Um, this teacup um so yeah i don't think i've ever actually managed to get these up on etsy yet because they all <laughs> always sell out so that is something uh, i need to concentrate on after i after i finished sort of everything else is going to be like getting all the products that i've been doing for conventions and fairs up on my etsy anyway for now i just need to press some of these so i've got i take out these pages and then i just press this front cover so my heat uh, my heat press is all done and ready to go now so yeah <laughs> i'm gonna get printing So these are all done now and I always put them back in their in their plastic sleeve uh, just to protect them while they're being transported and while they're being stored because um, I am taking these with me tomorrow to my last Christmas fair of the year so I, I always say I'm going to take them out when I put them on the table but I never I didn't, so far I never have I always forget and uh, nobody seems to mind uh, I do need to print out a new price label though that says um, that you can use them as diaries as well because they're, they're like notebook diaries, um, not for any particular year but they've got like certain pages divided up so you can write in the different days if you want to so I don't know I guess a label saying notebook slash diary should be fine so yes so now I've got plenty of these um, yeah because I don't know how, how popular tomorrow is going to be because I've never done um, this kind of fair in my town before so I will see how it goes so the only thing I have left to print today uh, I'm gonna do 
uh, a couple of my wall hangings, a couple of the, the pin display ones, the nice colourful ones. Uh, I, I might only do one or two of each colour and then I'm going to call it a day for that because I have been printing for, for hours now with the mugs and the notebooks. Um, so yeah, I'm going to set those to print and then get those done. And yeah, that, that'll be it for me today. Alright, so the printer is acting up and claiming that it can no longer recognise the ink cartridges, um, which is its way of saying that it's a bit low on ink, uh, and it really is only going to be a bit low. Uh, like, as soon as the ink gets less than halfway, it, it panics, um, and I can't be bothered to deal with it. So, that means that I have only printed one of these. Uh, I was hoping to be able to show you all three of the designs because I've just grabbed this from, from the other room. Uh, but as you can see, this one, this pink and purple cloud one, it comes out really nice, but <clears throat> it quits. <laughs> so the printer's quit on me, so oh, I can't be bothered to be topping up ink just to print like two more of these. So I'm going to leave it at this for now. Uh, yeah, you'll have seen this one before, but I think I changed it slightly from the last time you've seen it. So I had I have these stripes going more at a diagonal now. They were a lot, a lot of a shallower angle. Now they're more. I just I don't know. I just want them more going across like that. And then this one I designed a couple of months ago for started out as a gift for my friend, but I liked it so much that I I sell it now. Uh, but yeah, I would have liked to have shown you that one because it always sells out. But alas, no. So yeah, that's it for printing for today. So I've done mugs, books, and just one of these. And my feet are cold <laughs> from being stood on the, the hard floor. Uh, so yeah, I will leave it at that for now. I'll probably, I'll end up printing more on another day because this is my life now. <laughs> so I fancied uh, some nice soup tonight um, because <laughs> It's only half four and it's already completely dark outside. Um, so, so I'm in that sort of mood. Um, so, but I'm also not in the mood for uh, much chopping. So I've done the bare minimum. So I've chopped my bun of squash um, and I'm just going to roast all this, the onions, the sweet potato in the oven, uh, and then take them out, let them cool for a little bit. And then I'm just going to scoop these out, put it in a pan, probably add in some coconut milk to make it nice and creamy um because i'm a little bit busy so i've got some things i need to print so yeah this is just a quick sort of lazy way of doing soup you know to like roast everything first um but it, it always turns out nice so i'm gonna pop these in the oven now That about wraps it up for this week. Um, as you see, it is time to get on the Christmas jumpers. You will probably see a lot more of these. I have <laughs> quite a few because uh, my parents usually buy me one uh, once a year that I either get for my birthday in November or I get it for Christmas. So I've got quite a few now because it's a bit of a it's a bit of a tradition. <laughs> um, I will be doing soon. Uh, I don't think it'll be up by time. This vlog goes live. Uh, a giveaway on my Instagram because I passed 500 followers um, like a while back uh, and I didn't do anything for it. I was going to do something and I kind of sort of missed it. So it's kind of going to be for that, um, but it's also kind of going to be a Christmas giveaway. 
So it's probably going to be uh, a mug um, and some other little bits uh, and it'll, it'll just be like a comment to enter type of thing. Um, so, but I'll announce it on Instagram when I'm when I'm ready for that because it should be soon so I can get it uh, shipped out uh, in time for somebody for Christmas. But it, it is going to have to be um, a UK only one. So yeah, sorry if you're, if you're international. Um, oh, my fair the other day. The first one went all right. That one was a very short one. That was only a couple hours long because it was like an evening one for um, kids. It was uh, it was like a place nearby was raising money for like rainbows, brownies, and, and guides and things. Um, so it's not one I've ever done before. Um, so there was an, an hour of just like manic, just children everywhere. Uh, so that was all right. And then the other one that I did the other day, uh, that was at a place that's really close to my house. That one was pretty quiet honestly uh that one definitely could have been better so i'm not sure if i'm going to do that one in the future um but it was kind of it wasn't the normal type of thing i would apply for it was um it was like called a mind body and spirit fair so there were a lot of people uh selling crystals and things like that which you know is there, that doesn't go sort of with what i sell you know mine's more art and things so i was a bit of the odd one out <laughs> So, but I am booking more things uh, for next year because I would like to do more of the the really big conventions and things. I think that I think that's the way to go for me. Um, I, I will still be doing sort of like local ones and little ones, but I would like to do more big ones and be much more prepared this time because the stress. Yeah. So yeah, got uh, lots of plans. Uh, and I've already started a list of like, uh, I guess goals for next year because there's a bunch of stuff that I want to do. Uh, but going to the the big cons is is one of them. <coughs> excuse me, uh, and doing more of them, just more in general. Like I don't need to be doing a lot because I've got my Etsy shop to run, um, so I need time for that. But I also don't want to like do so few fairs and conventions that it's not worth it. You know, I want to do several. If I could do one a month, maybe one, maybe two months then, that's probably enough for me. I don't want to go crazy. I don't want to be one of these people that does um, fairs and conventions every weekend. That's a bit too much for me. Um, I've known people who have done that and at the end of the year they're just dead. <laughs> oh no, I want to have some fun. Um, so yeah, so yeah, keep your eye out on Instagram for the giveaway that will be soon. Um, and yeah, happy December since we're already we already started. Um, but yeah, God, I've got so much Christmas stuff to do. I haven't bought everyone presents yet, so I've got to do that <laughs> first. Uh, but yeah, thank you uh, very much for watching. I hope you liked my um, my footage of my birthday sort of celebration in Leeds. Uh, that was nice. I know I didn't I didn't get a huge amount of footage, but you know, so I was I was out with my friends, so I was just there to like enjoy myself, not so much to make a video. Um, so yeah, anyway, I will see you next week. Thank you very much for watching. Bye!